Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to share a review on the ink bottle which is violet and it's by the company Brill. Normally if you take inks you might think of like blue ink or black ink or maybe even red ink. But well today I thought of going a little bit different you know because I have purchased this bottle right about almost a month ago and I bought it for the Deccan pen stores which is like near my house only. So yeah, firstly let me tell you a bit about the company. Now the company Brill is Indian and it is originating from the city of Bangalore in around the year 1964. They have made numerous ink colors some of which we will see in the video. Well, firstly let's look at the box. You have a little bit fountain photo there. Violet ink, Brill, their company logo. Let's move to the other side and there we go. You can see the other ink colors that they also have. You can see their blue, violet, blue, black, red, black, laurel, rose, turquoise, blue, green. And they have given some bit of info here. Like you know it's highly important if you want to ink your pen with like a different color of ink. Then definitely you have to just clean it up with water. So they have given that. You can see the price is around 30 rupees which is around like a dollar and like couple cents. It's pretty low priced and it's it does quite great job in, in it. And that's pretty much the box. You can see they also sell other stationery products. Uh, you can see here they are celebrating the 50th year I guess. So that's a golden jubilee. Violet is also written there. Let's take the box open and yeah this is the ink bottle it's made up of glass completely i mean i know from first bit it looks a bit like black if you zoom in you know you could see a little bit of blue there and that's your cap right so before i do anything what i want to do is i want to take a earbud dip it in the ink and put it all of the paper. This is known as a swatch test. It's also used for checking how fast the ink dries or what its quality is. You know when you like put it all over the paper. So let's get over to the swatch test. Okay so we have all our things set up here. The earbud. You can see it looks a lot like violet. And let's dip it. There we go. And let's swatch it all over the paper. Okay, so firstly it bends a lot towards, you know, the dark shade of blue. But overall in some of the lighter parts like here and here, you can see that violet popping up extremely well. And I think it's best under the daylight, you know, because that's when you'll know that it's actually violet thing. Let's look at these lines. They are all violet. I think under normal you know like room lights and all this could look a bit like dark blue but still you would be able to see a difference. Well that's about the swatch test. Let's give Alright so now for the handwriting test. This is a Camlin Trinity. It's currently filled up with the Brill ink violeting that you're seeing here. And well let's post it and let's write. I mean first thoughts it looks a lot like a you know deep dark shade of blue but I guess somehow you'll be able to see that violet there there you go I mean yeah it looks like a lot of like a downshaded version of dark blue but yeah, it does its job. It does say it's violet. It looks violet. It is violet. I guess this would be some nice camouflage, you know, for someone says you need to use blue ink. Maybe you can use a, you know, shade of this and then test it out. Well, let's cap it and get your closer look. Here you go. I mean, yeah, it looks a lot like blue to me. 
but still i guess it won't be that much on the camera yeah i mean this looks a bit like blue but if you you know zoom in well concentrate well then it looks like violet it's quite nice it's a great alternative definitely would love to try other rings and overall you know it does its job there's the bottle there it's great i mean it's a low price definitely worth it and that's pretty much all i have to say and thanks for watching